Well, a transit advocacy group is claiming the TTC was warned about problems before the SRT derailed last summer. TTC Riders says four reports by external consultants were discovered on the agency's website but were not reported to the board at a public meeting. The report claims the TTC was alerted to two problems that ended up being contributing factors to the derailment, yet stopped doing some preventative maintenance work. TTC Riders says the reports raise troubling questions about how maintenance and inspections are done across the system. It's calling on management to explain why they failed to act on warnings. And Councillor Josh Matlow is on the TTC board and he says the report is concerning. The consultant who wrote the report suggested that even the confusion in these numbers may have been one of the factors that led to the derailment itself. It's important to ask these questions about this confusing sort of magical number situation in the report. Not only for accountability about the SRT derailment in Scarborough, but also to know that all of the facts that we receive about the state of repair of the entire system, including our subway, is based on facts. The TTC board heard a presentation from the RT derailment back in September, but none of those findings in the consultant reports were part of it. 